Hey everyone, I'm very excited for this video because we're gonna do two things. First of all, I have a new bag that I'm gonna unbox and show you before we go out. Then also, we're gonna be going to Bista Village. Now, I'm actually going there tomorrow, so I haven't filmed it at the time of this video, but I'm gonna put in some clips here, some like highlights of the things that I end up seeing. I'm very much hoping to get into Dior, although the queue at Dior at Bista Village is always like really very long. So, and it's normally always raining whenever I go there and I never want to queue in the rain. So we'll see what that's like. Hopefully it's not raining and there's no queue or not a very big queue, but that's the plan for that. But th let's start with this bag. So you know that I'm really into the Hermes Constance. I'm gonna wait. I, I know some of you have said to me, would I buy it pre-loved? I wouldn't because I don't want to pay overs for it and also I have a very particular style, colourway, leather, uh, uh, all, you know all of that kind of thing is very particular to me and I would rather hopefully one day be offered it so that I can custom pick what it is that I actually want as opposed to buying something that's got a markup on it and it's not quite what I'm after um, but this bag I'm going to show you here ticks my boxes when it comes to the kind of aesthetic style that I like about the Constance. So everything is in this dust bag, or the bags in this dust bag. And this bag is by a brand called Ateliers Auguste. And look at this, and you wait until you see the grain, the texture on this. This is um, lizard, it's not actual lizard, it's uh, leather, but it's embossed with this lizard design. It's got gold hardware on it. This brand was actually founded back in 2012 by um, two brothers, the Valembert brothers, and they're both very into design, but also into architecture. And I feel that you can really see that on their bags. There is a simplicity on their bags that is beautiful. Even things like on this clasp here, the way you've got these corrugated lines that go through, that to me reminds me of architecture. Like to me personally, when I saw it, I thought, yeah, I, I kind of get that sense of the architecture background in this design of bag. So it's crossbody. The strap is non-removable, but I don't think you'd want to remove it anyway. It's crossbody. You can get this in two sizes. There is one smaller than this, but I wanted the larger one because I'm like a taller person and I, I'm finding recently that very small bags get a bit lost on me. So I wanted to get the larger size, plus I can do more with it as well. Um, some of the things that I also love about this brand are that all of their stuff, and I spoke about this last year, about how with a lot of the big name players, they actually claim that things are made in Europe when they're not. They're made in other places around the world, which is not great when it comes to the environmental impact. Um, but also I feel like it's very misleading because you buy something assuming it's made in France, let's say, and it's not, and it never was. It was designed in France, but it was made elsewhere. With their pieces, they're all designed in Paris. The handbags are all made in Italy and the small leather goods are all made in Portugal. And that's something that they guarantee. And that's something that I really like about the brand that you do actually know the ethics behind it. Like they're very about quality, about ethics, but also about a fair price and things being reasonably priced. So if you're in the market for a very good quality, discreet, very quiet luxury actually, um, designer bag then go and check them out um, and I will link to them uh, below. I can't remember if I said they did actually give me a coupon code to share with you all. I don't earn commission from the coupon code so if you do use it don't think oh I want to use it but you earn a commission because I don't so um, don't worry about that. The other thing that I thought I'd show you is in this. This is from Radley. And I went out with David the other day and we don't normally go, normally when we go shopping, we'll go to Harrods or something. We won't go to, you, we won't go to your average high street. Do you know why? Because in the UK, I'm not sure how many of you agree with this, but when we go to like, like when we go to Guildford, for example, which is one of our favorite places outside of London, when we go there, loads of the shops are like derelict and closed down and it feels really depressing. And so, we don't tend to go to those places and, and yet we should because part of the reason why everything is closed down and derelict is because so many of us are shopping online now. Uh, but we went out and I found a place that sold Radley and I saw this cutest thing. It's actually for Valentine's Day, 
but wait until you see, look at this. It is a little zippy wallet. It was 59 pounds, didn't cost like Dior money where it's like 400 pounds. It's really well made, I love the quality of it. I actually got this to keep my AirPods in and also um, when I go out and I'm not using my AirPods to keep my keys in because my car keys actually fit in this and I want something I always get this thing like whenever I go out I get a panic in, in case I've left my car keys somewhere because I do this I go in shops like I'll go in Harrods I'll sit down for a chat in Fendi or Dior or Gucci or wherever and I'll leave stuff there and then I'm like what did I do with that oh my god I left it on the counter and I've got to go back I do this a lot so if I can keep everything in here and keep it tucked in my bag that's exactly what I want to do and these are the two things together very cute so I'm going to be using these tomorrow um but anyway uh today is Thursday tomorrow is Friday next time you see me we will be shopping good morning everyone I'm with David David's driving at the moment um a lot of you are like oh my god don't because you're driving and I'm it, because we're in the UK we're on different side of the road so you haven't got a steering wheel I don't have a steering wheel either but a lot of people are like oh you're driving and you're filming I'm not driving don't worry we are on our way to Bista Village and I really enjoy a Bista Village day out. I just really like it there. The only downside is it's quite a drive away. Is it? Yes. It takes a little bit of time to get there from London which is a downside but it's so worth it by the time that you get there. Sorry about the light that's like coming through from the side. Um, but yeah that's what we're going to do today. I really want to have a look in Dior. I've heard the Dior there Wobbly. Do I need lift on this? Mm, no, but you can use lift on it, yeah. Here we've just arrived. So we always go in this valet parking area just because it's it's wider. It's £35 to park here, so it's not like cheap, but as I say, if you're worried about your car, it's really worth doing. We got a Ten pounds off because we parked here. Um, food. That's pretty good, isn't it? Yeah, that's quite good. Do you want to have a view of the car? Let me see how far back I can get. Yeah, the car looking good. And there's David just getting our stuff out of the front. Luckily, it look oh, fire engine. Luckily, it looks quite quiet here today, so we might actually be lucky getting into Dior. As you can see, quite quiet. And we're not even here particularly early, actually. Normally, obviously, the earlier you get here, the more chance you have of getting in places. Just come to use the ladies, and I know it's really random to film this, but the bathrooms at Bista Village are so nice. <laughs> you can't beat them. Always very clean and very beautiful. Okay, so now we are going to go and head to Dior and hopefully the queue's not going to be too big there. I'm really hoping it's not. Look at this. You know how they've got these little outdoor spaces where they show different products from different stores? This is Maison Margiela. Look at that tiny bag. You know I like a tiny bag. It really is quite small. Very cute. thought I'd show you what was going on here. I've just stopped at um, Holland Cooper and I'm actually going skiing. Um, soon and they have got my dream ski jacket which is this one the houndstooth and look they've also got a really nice scarf that matches and even the ski trousers are amazing I don't think you can see properly from there let's go in and have a look should we have a look let's go in
here we've got Kenzo to show you some of what's in the window there Valentino I'm literally running to Dior sorry everyone Dior is where we're on our way to for sure at the moment here we've got some mulberry at one of these other like out stand things got the Bayswater there I don't think they do that particular Bayswater style anymore that was always my favorite you know and then we've got the Alexa that's nice that's actually a really nice color I quite like that very unusual and then we've got some mini bags here we found Dior and there's no queue what have they got in the window let's check it out oh oh don't worry there is a bag there I think I remember that and then over here I also remember these bags how many of you remember these and in Dior typically there's 40% off I also do remember those boots and that bag also comes in black if you're interested in that let's go and check it out David's already got it I wonder if all of this is discounted oh my god look at that that bag yeah. what do you think of it in the leopard do you like it they never are <laughs> Got some ready to wear actually correction it's 50 percent off Thirty-five percent off the cushion. Actually quite like those. They actually are. <laughs> Found this amazing hat. You know, it matches the coat I've got, and that is the price. It's reversible, just like that coat I've got that some of you might have seen. So I'm just going to try it on in my size. So that's Dior done, and I got that amazing hat, which I'm so pleased about. And this is Gucci. I'm going to go in, but um, to quickly show you what's in the window, because you know when you go in, it can be tricky to film. Now, the thing is with, Gu with Dior... Everything is X display stuff that didn't sell from previous collections. With Gucci, some of it is, but some of it is also, oh, they're nice, aren't they? Those lilac ones. Some of them are also new stock that are at full price. So when you come here, don't get sucked into the price and jump in and buy. Always Google it before you buy anything because you can end up buying stuff that is actually full price. So that's that little bit of information for you there, but let's um let's go in and see what we can film. Hopefully we can. The pink one. Not that I'm gonna get it because I already got the blue one, but oh they are. I don't know. This must be from a collaboration. 
and that. That is cute, that little bag at the back, that tote. This was like a collaboration they did. Yeah, this is quite good. That's real 70s. Football style. I'm not really a fan of it. I never yeah, really it's was. 70s. It's your 70s. There's more of that collection there. I quite like that. It's really sweet. I know I've tried this on before, but it always catches my eye whenever I come here. 870 from 1740. What do you think? I never liked it when you showed me the first time. You never liked it? Yeah. Hmm. I've got to show you this stand because for any of you into Mark Jacobs, they've just opened a Mark Jacobs store here. And I'm going to try and find it because um, it's quite big in here. I will try and find it and film in there but here are some goodies and of course as always you don't know what's full price and what isn't I would imagine though from what I can see here this will all be discounted because it looks quite seasonal we've just made it into farm shop which is like one of our favorite restaurants here the food here is so good and it's kind of like almost like pub food in a way and I think David was looking at what were you looking at again oh yeah the avocado with poached egg he was looking at that this is what we ordered. I got the chicken scallop. David got the fries and some eggs. Uh, smashed avocado with poached eggs. This all looks very nice. This smells amazing. That's lunch done. And we're just walking past Jimmy Choo. And I thought, hmm, maybe I'll have a look in there. Look at the cute little fluffy bag there. They've got some quite nice boots as well. Shall we have a look in? Come on, everyone, let's go in. Let's have a look. Oh, quite like those as well, in a way. Do I? Hmm, not sure. And it's up to 40% off in here. They're so cute. I like that little purple one. What do you think? Or do you prefer the bigger ones? Um. Or the smaller ones? Yeah. I don't know. Really like no? I just want to look at this one in the mirror. Hello. Is this connected to anything? Yeah. No, it's not. That is very nice. This is the smaller size. Actually, the small one's just as nice, isn't it? This mini bag, 432. Oh, the pink's, oh, the pink's cute. The pink is 50%. Oh, that one's maybe a bit less. Yes, this is less. This is 325. 325. Oh, that's very cute, isn't it? Yeah. I really like these. These are 620. Really nice knee high boots. we got some pink as well some sparkle that is really nice isn't it that tiny one the tiny gold bag go on go on go on what's the price 6.50 very sweet because the handles like oh, pearls. I like the handles got pearls That's on actually it. Nice. that actually is really nice is there a price on that? 831 from like 1250. Prices in here are very good. Very good. 
just found these amazing snow boots for my trip and I've tried them on and they're so cute. So far so good. I've got a couple of purchases here. Um, now we're going to have a look in coach because I'm a big coach fan. I like it in here. Let's see what they've got. Nice trench coats I can see already. Like these trench coats. Oh wow! And this one, fifty nine pounds. My gosh, you guys, look, they've got heart bags. Oh, aren't they cute? And look, more for Valentine's Day. This is 189 from 325, this camera bag. Very cute. Then they've got like heart things down here. But this, how much is this? Let's have a look. 259 from 395. I quite like this one, you know, with the little pattern on it there. Same price. And there it is there. I've got this in red and I love it. Okay, everyone, I'm having to move to the microphone because I got to the back of the shop in coach and it was ridiculous. It was like a nightclub in there. The music was so loud that I've just edited it. And besides the fact I get killed for copyright, you can't actually hear what I'm saying. But if you do go to the back of the shop, anything on the price tag that has a red sticker on it or is an actual red sticker has had an extra markdown put on it. Now in some of the stores, if you go in and you have a look, they normally have a shelf that, oh, that tends to look a little bit messy and it's got on it like a bunch of stuff that's up to 50% discounted, sometimes up to 70%. So if you're a coach fan, these are some of the things that I found on the day. There was a lot of like um, items from the Disney collaboration which if you're into that i would imagine that's like quite collectible if you're like a, a coach person so yeah when you go into coach at bista go to the back of the store that's where you will find the good stuff i also did find um a really nice pair of ballet flats and i f oh, i forget how much they were i'll you'll see the price in one second because i'll show you i think they were like 129 pounds or something but these are them and again if you're into ballet flats we're going into spring um hopefully very soon right everyone that was um that was coach and now i'm just going to go into fendi and i'm going to try and film what i can but you know how it goes it's not always easy so let's go was Fendi there was actually nothing really in there to be honest as hopefully you saw from that but now we're going to go into Ferragamo which is where I got my green bag from you know that green bag that you've seen before that I showed you um, this is where it's from so let's check it out this is the section it was in where it's like there's money off but then there's extra money off there's some nice stuff here This is quite sweet. I do like this bag. It's quite nice and weighty as well, quite heavy. We're gonna go and check out Kate Spade because I just saw her in the window. Look, they've got heart stuff for Valentine's Day. 
heart bags and jumpers, lots of things. So let's have a look. Look at this, 259 with the pearl top handle. How cute is that? That. It's actually quite sweet. You see it's lump there and a lump there. Yeah, there is, it is a bit lumpy on the edges. This one's 189 from 299 if you're interested in the smaller one, but that wouldn't fit your phone. It would fit the phone I'm filming in, which is the little flip Samsung, but not like a regular phone, I would say. Or oh, there's some more here. That's nice too, that shape. Okay, so that's Kate Spade done and like right opposite is Christian Louboutin. Now I'm not going to be able to film in here because security are already looking at me through the door. Um, but I'm going to go in and see if there's anything worth buying. Okay, right, so that was Christian Louboutin. I was actually a bit surprised because there wasn't much stock in there. Um, the discounts were pretty good, like 35-40%, but stock-wise there wasn't really anything in there. Even if I could have filmed, there wasn't really anything in there that I could have shown you. So I'm just going to carry on walking around the village and uh, see where we come to next. Here is what's going on in Celine. So we've got, how many of you recognise this? I remember this bag. There was the mini size, then there's the larger size there. 40% um, off in Celine. Yeah. Not like, not like loads going on in there, I will say, um, in terms of stock. So Furla, I enjoy Furla, I like it. They have got 40% off, up to 40% off. And these are some of their pieces. And I can see back there actually, up to 70% off. Um, I'm gonna try and go in and film, although there's lots of security in here, so I'm not sure I'm gonna be able to. Been in Gina for years. I used to be a real fan of their stuff because everything was super sparkly. But everything in here is up to 40% off. Some sparkly shoes there in the window. So for any of you who are into this kind of thing, it's worth you going in. They have a lot of stock. I would go in, but they're looking at me through the window, so I can't. <laughs> I'm really sorry. We've just arrived at Burberry and Mm, from memory, I think Burberry is another one where not everything is discounted. Some of it is actually current full price stock, but we'll go in and check it out and see what they've got. There's like a quite a nice scarf there and there's some bags in the window. I don't know whether they're discounted or not, but we'll soon find out. So we've got the Burberry Trench, and this is 1890, so not discounted, but they do have 30% off in here today if you spend 700 pounds or over. So that's pretty good on that. And now finally, we're gonna go in Prada, 
and as you know as with a lot of these stores some of them are easier to film in than others um we'll try we'll try and we'll see what we can um <laughs> see what we can get yeah So you could do I Kill Kenny with this? Or the one down there. That's worse. Yeah. No, we've got it in yellow. Yeah, I know. So that means we'll have this in yellow as I well. Know. These are very cute. Hair clips, aren't they? Okay. Possible. I don't know. You're me I, don't know. You. I don't know. David just picked this one out and it is actually quite nice. Little bucket bag with Prada on it. Decent size. It is 590 down from 8. No, no 9. It's it's a lot. It's a lot. It's not even nice. David doesn't like it. I kind of do, but it's quite wild. Oh, and look what they've got over there. Let's have a look over here. These are it. What do you think of this? I don't like it. Do you? No. No. This is quite cute though. How much? I don't know how much they are. Oh, hang on, hang on. 900 from 1,500. This is... 820 from 1,350. They're always gone. I know who, I know who takes those. I know who wears those. And then finally, finally before we head home, I was just walking past Tory Birch and I was like, we need to go in and check this out and see what they've got. Look at these quite cool bags. And their prices are always really good. Even before a discount, their prices are really good. What did you see? No? Hair clips. Yeah. <laughs> These are nice. These types of areas. Fifty percent off this section. How much is this little pouch? Oh, look! You can even charge it through the underneath bit. So it's like one hundred nine pounds minus fifty percent. Still quite a lot for something that's like that small, I suppose.
In the excitement of it all, I completely forgot to film an ending, so I'm really sorry about that, but I do just wanna come on here and say, for any of you still here, congratulations, because it's been a long video. Thank you so much for watching, and come back and join me very soon for the next one.